Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Everledger and today I am back with another Pixel Gun 3D video. So I was not planning on recording today because I had a video pre-recorded yesterday for today, but that's going to be pushed to tomorrow because I had a crazy idea. So basically, Pixel Gun developers gave us a little picture that showed how many gems and how many weapons have been removed from these hacked accounts that have, are getting banned. So, with that being said, about 47 billion hacked gems have been removed from the game from these hacked accounts and a couple million hacked weapons. So originally, I was not going to make a video on this because it's just one picture. I'll show the picture on screen right here, but I wasn't going to make a video because, well, it's just one picture. There's not much to talk about. And then I had a crazy idea to use these numbers to calculate how much money has been stolen from Pixel Gun 3D. So with that being said, yes, this is not going to be the 100% number as this is just from two days of banning and people are still getting banned. But from these numbers right here, there's going to be how much money Pixel Gun 3D has had stolen from them. And it's going to be less than the actual number because people have been banned after these numbers were released. So that being said, let's go ahead and do the math right here on video to show you guys how much money has been stolen. So if you go into the shop, you can get 3,600 gems for $129.99, US dollars that is. And they said that 47 billion hacked gems were removed. So if you can do some simple math right here, 47 billion divided by 3,600, you'll be able to get how many of these $129.99 packs were used to get these weapons. Now, keep in mind, these were not actually bought. These were all hacked. So if you do that math right there, you get 13,055,555.55. Meaning that 13,055,555.55 of these packs were bought. So you can see how much money was stolen if you take that number right there and multiply that by 129.99. And when you do that, you get 1,697,091,666.67 dollars. Meaning that Pixel Gun Company has lost over 1.5 billion dollars because of these hacked accounts. Now, lots of you people who did get banned are trying to claim that um, it's okay because the first actual person who made the account bought all the weapons. Even if they did that... They're still copying all that data to multiple accounts to share it to everyone. If you don't understand what I mean by that, here's an analogy for you. Let's say you are a YouTuber and you just dropped some merchandise. You're selling a t-shirt for $20 and one person, only one person, buys that t-shirt for $20. After that, they go online and make an exact copy of that and start giving it or selling it to everybody else, which is taking the money away from you because they're not giving the money to you. Meaning all that money is being stolen from you, and that's what's happening here with the developers. One person bought everything into the game, copied it 200,000 times, and gave it away to 200,000 people. So 200,000 people do not have what they deserved, and that is why these people are getting hacked, or banned. But when I did this math, I just thought that was crazy. Now obviously, if none of these modded accounts happened, um, they would not have gained $1.6 billion because, well, people wouldn't have bought all that. This is because they could hack it. Really, if you have the tools to hack it, um, that's because you don't want to buy it. But in total, they lost nearly $1.7 billion as of the numbers we have right now due to these hacking problems. Which honestly, on top of that, so many people are out here bashing Echo Soldier and claiming that he's the reason that they got banned from Pixel Gun 3D. I'm going to tell you guys right now, I'm not the biggest Echo Soldier fan, but I am definitely on his side with this as he's not the cause of these people getting banned. So stop blaming Echo Soldier. He did not make you hack. You chose to hack the game or you chose to use a modded account and that's why you're getting banned. Quit blaming people for your mistakes. You were told six months ago that they're going to be starting to ban these accounts and you chose to not play for fairly and to keep modding on the account. So anyways guys, that is going to be this video. I hope you guys did enjoy this. This is a very interesting number right here about how much money they have lost. And honestly, I know it's a pretty short video, but I thought you guys would want to know this because this is just insane. If you guys do want to see more content, make sure you guys leave a like and comment down below whether you think these people were rightfully banned or not. If you guys do want to see more content, make sure you guys subscribe and turn on notifications. And, I mean, if you want to support my channel, just go down below and click the copy the link and share it with whoever you want to. 
But with that being said, I really hope you guys had or have a blessed day, and I will see you all in the next video. Tell me, tell me, tell me